there are times in your life when you, the kind of cross that you're carrying, the kind of burden that you're feeling burdened with, of course, we know Christ died for us. But it is under that pressure of a situation where you, there's nothing you could do but go through. You can't, you, you don't know which way to go, you just know that you're standing and whatever this cross is, you're laying it at the foot of the cross of Jesus. But I want you to understand something. Don't let people make you feel that when you come and you lay it at the feet of Jesus and at his cross, that all of a sudden you feel your burden lift. Sometimes you know in faith that you are giving it to him, but you are still experiencing the pain and heartache. I'm telling you, when there's nobody else to turn to, first of all, I want you all to know, thank God for the times when people let you down. Because it is when you fix your gaze on him, and they may not do it deliberately, they're just not there, you will see the light. You will see the light. Because when you kneel at that cross, and you say, God, I know you suffered more than I'm suffering now. And I'm giving this to you, because you are the burden bearer. And I don't know which way I'm going, but I know I'm going through with you. The darkness begins to clear. The darkness begins to clear. And you see the light. This is what I'm talking about. But you've got to make up your mind. Switch off the phone. Switch off the whatever. And simply go before the Lord. And you will see the light. Hope can only come through Jesus. Hope don't come through people. Of course, God uses people in our lives. He doesn't want us to be alone, but hope comes when you realize there's nobody else to help you. Only through Jesus, hope comes because he is hope. Hope can't come from anybody else. So relish the times when you're either let down or there's nobody to call. He's not going to leave you so all the time because we are maturing and sometimes... The community is important. But oh, to have that time when you're misunderstood, you're forgotten, trampled on, and left to cope. Hope comes. Hallelujah. And so, Father, we thank you that your mercies are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness, because of who you are. Because of who you are. Hallelujah. And you have to know, it, some things are not fixed by yourself. But you've got to take time by yourself to pray through and wait at the foot of the cross. Hallelujah.